and I'm here with Jed, one of the heads of the site, and we were just going to ask him some questions, is that cool? Sounds like a plan. Cool. So, um, I heard that you and your friend Vince came up with this. How did you, what's the background story on that? Well, me and my friend Vince have been best friends since we were five years old. We both grew up together in Maryland, right outside of D.C. Uh, Vince was working at Warner Music Group as an A&R, and uh, you know, they were looking for new products. You know, with music sales going down, they were looking for other ways to make these artists money and expand their brand. Um, and he came across this company at a trade show that was doing skins. And the skins that they were doing were primarily for art. Um, and instantly it hit him and he said, you know, we should do this for music. Um, so he actually started talking with that company and you know decided he was going to launch music skins and he tried to do it for about a year by himself and realized after a year there was no way he was going to be able to get it done and then one day we were sitting there and we decided you know it was about time that we started working together and you know that's the day that uh, music skins was born and we just kind of took off running from there cool so about how many skins do you have Right now, we have probably over 1,200 designs and over 250 devices. So hundreds of thousands of items to choose from. Very cool. What's your favorite? What's my favorite? That's, that's a good question. Uh, right now, I have a SpongeBob skin on my phone, which is one of our newest uh, designs that we've launched from Nickelodeon. Uh, I really like the Pink Floyd Dark Side of the Moon skin. Uh, I like the Jay-Z Blueprint 3. And then I like some of the art stuff. You know, that, might not be as popular, but I think it's really cool. And Interesting. So, for all of this art that you make skins out of, do you get like licensing for that? Yeah, so basically what we do is we go to the record level labels, we go to the TV studios, we go to the artists, and we set up licensing deals with them. You know, so they all get you know, a royalty paid on everything that's sold, and all of our licenses are worldwide exclusive. So, all the stuff that you see at, on musicskins.com, you can't get anywhere else. Very cool. So, if you were to have a bestseller, what do you think it would be? Well, for the, this past holiday season, Justin Bieber has been far and away our bestseller. It's pretty just amazing what this kid has done. You see him everywhere. Um, and now SpongeBob's our new, uh, one of our newest properties, and we think SpongeBob's going to be one of our bestsellers as well. Um, the Beatles has always been a great seller. Taylor Swift has been doing really well because of her new album. Um, those are pretty much the best sellers right now. I was exploring your site and I saw there was a custom tool. Can you explain that to us? Yeah, so you know we have over 1,200 designs to choose from, but you know not everybody wants to have a band, brand, or artist on their you know on their cell phone or their laptop or their iPod. So we created a customizer tool in which you could upload your own photos, uh, your own artwork, your own logos. So maybe you have your own band and you want to create your own skins, or maybe it's just a picture of your dog and your family. Um, you can upload it, you can add text to it, you can add colors, um, and then you know you get a custom skin. Cool. And you've heard it from us, everybody. Go to www.musicskin.com and check it out. Signing off.